I'm Kevin Frankish at Bill Carruthers Secondary School in Unionville. Every year I work with York Regional Police to kick off their seasonal red ribbon campaign. A reminder not to drink and drive, especially during the holiday season. In Canada every day on our roads, four people are killed and 170 people are injured. My niece, Ashley, 23 years old, and her best friend, Alyssa, were heading to Casino Rama to go to a concert. When an impaired driver, 27 year old man, crossed the center line, hit her head on, Ashley died on impact. She was a person who contributed to society. She didn't take away from society. The person that killed her was drunk and he was stoned on the Razapin. It was yesterday morning at around 10 to 6 when a good friend and colleague of mine lost someone. That individual was killed in a motor vehicle collision involving a suspected impaired driver. Today, I have a friend whose family has lost a son, a son-in-law, a husband, and a father. The reality is, in, that I, in our high school careers, we will have to make that decision to choose to drink or to drive, to get into a car with a drunk driver, or to see a friend get into a car with a drunk driver. Now, I've made the vow that I'll be that person to choose not to drink and drive. I promise to call 911 if I think someone is driving in here. You know, it's very difficult to tell the difference between being impaired and not being impaired. So the safest thing to do to prevent being a criminal, prevent being injured or killed or doing the same to others, if you're going to drink, don't drive. If you use drugs, don't drive. Every year we always end off these assemblies asking the students to answer to three quick vows and you can do it as well. I won't drive impaired, I won't get into a vehicle with someone who's been impaired, and I will call 911 if I know someone is driving impaired. I'm Kevin Frankish at Bill Crothers Secondary School in Unionville.